Full which chapter is going on? Hello? In yes. school which chapter is going on? Sound. Sound only. Last Sunday's test you have written? So no, sir, I didn't have time only. Like then, no, then then today you will write now because what can I do now? Uh -huh, today you write. Nothing else we can do. Let the portion get over next year. If you are not able to find the time, this is the only solution. I know, sir. Sorry. I mean, this week full I have to submit projects. Uh, like tomorrow I have to submit. Hey, uh, Saksham. Saksham, see, earlier also I told you have got handful of potential. Don't violate it. Yes, sir. Because I know you have ample of potential, only you have to be coordinated well. So just write down this planner 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, till 20. Chapter 7, we will study today question number 1 to 5 only from 7a. Then same 7a, 6 to 10, 7a, 10 to 16, Friday, you will do 7a, just two MCQs are there, MCQ plus 5 numerical, here 6 to 11 numerical. Sunday test on sound part A, 7A. Monday will practice numericals from chapter 1. Chapter 1. All numericals will practice. Just write down. Last class I did, I think, till what are light waves and sound wave distinguished, correct? Yes, sir. First, I'm doing all numericals for. Because numerical me kuch jada dam nahi. Fat fat numerical khatam kar deta ho, then I'm coming to jail. Shall I clear this? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Photo le leta uska. Okay, done. Shall I start? Yes, sir. Eight second, eight second, chart. First, wavelength. Wavelength is denoted by which letter? O? Lambda. Lambda, correct. 
wavelength of wave produced on the surface of water is 20 centimeters. If wave velocity means V is 24 meter per second, calculate number of wave, number of wave produced in one second. Number of wave per second is called frequency. Yes, sir. Time in which one wave is produced is called time period. Yes, sir. Is V frequency into wavelength? Yes, sir. So frequency will be V upon lambda. V is 24. Lambda is 20 centimeter. Multiply with 10 raised to minus 2 to convert into meter. Therefore, 24 into 10 raised to 2 upon 20. 24 into 100 upon 20, 20 into 5, 5 into 4, 20, 120 per second or hertz. Then time is 1 upon frequency, 1 upon 120. I'm writing here 1000 and 10 raised to minus 3. So it is 1 only. No? Multiply by 1000, divide by 1000 to make the calculation easy. This you followed what I did? 10 raised to plus 3. 10 raised yes, to minus sir. 3. 12 eights are 96. Remainder 4, 40. 12 into 3, 36. Remainder 4, 40. So 3, 3, 3 recurring. Ho 10 raised to minus 3. Clear? This sum? Yes, sir. Solve. Saksham, you are there? Hello, Saksham, you are there? Can I have a kid? Oh, sir, you're only. Can you hear me? Ah, I can hear you. mindset change for up. Either sick, either poch name, Valeo. Yes, I'll do. I'll do. Pakka. I come as Utro cap, the art the salme, I said position for Ogena. The people will have to take time to meet you. They can throw us up the mindset for change for. Okay, sir. Then, sir. Calculate minimum distance in air between the source of sound and obstacle to hear echo. Minimum distance between source and obstacle to hear echo. If the speed is 350 meter per second. To hear echo, what is time interval required? One tenth of second, na? Huh? Yes, Time sir. interval for echo is t equals to one tenth of second. Matlab, jo reflected wave aayega, one tenth ke baad agar apne kaan ke parde pe aata hai, to we can hear it clear. So, speed is total distance 2D upon time. Because this is source, this is obstacle, ja ke aane mein, Total time T laga. So distance D, D will get 2D ho gaya. Okay? Hello? Yes, sir. So can I say therefore, uh, distance D will be B into T upon 2? Hello? Yes, sir. So that means... Speed is distance upon time. Therefore, distance will be Vt upon 2. 
b is 350 b is 1 by 10 upon 2 0 0 cancel 17.5 meter is minimum distance required for echo to be heard copy second one Done, sir. Okay. Third, what should be minimum distance between source and reflector in water so that echo is heard distinctly? Again, distance d we want. Time you should know it should be one ten. In water, speed is given. One thousand four hundred meter per second. Logic is same. Speed is distance upon time. So speed v is two d upon t. Therefore, distance will be v t upon two. V is fourteen hundred. T is one by ten divided by two. Zero zero cancel. Equals to seventy meter. Same concept. Do. Done. Third one. Sir, one minute. Okay. Answer.
a man standing 25 meter away from a wall so its distance from wall is 25 meter distance from the wall 25 meter produces sound and receives reflected sound calculate time after which he receives the reflected sound time after which he receives reflected sound matlab echo if the speed of sound in air is given 350 meter per second will the man be able to hear distinct echo explain the reason if the time is greater than 1 upon 10 or equal to 1 upon 10 that means greater to or equal to point where he can hear isse kam hoga to it won't he can't hear because mix ho jayega sound now speed in air is total distance upon time time is 2d upon speed in air so 2 into 25 upon speed in air 350 5 into 5 5 into 735 Two into five, ten upon seventy. So one by seven. This is zero point seven into one is seven. Uh, ten may say fifty. Then three is left out. Seven into four twenty eight. Two is left out. Approximately two twenty means I can take twenty one. This many second. Is it greater than point one? Is it greater than point one second? Yes, sir. That means he can hear, no? Yes, sir. Thus, echo can be heard. So, so time after which reflected sound is coming is more than point one, so he can hear clearly. Yes, the echo can be heard. None, sir. Okay. Did somebody put the token? A radar sends signal. 
to an aeroplane at distance 300 km away. Radar sends signal to aeroplane which is 300 km away. Distance is 300 km. That is 300 into 1000 meter. 10 raised to 3 means 1000. With speed of 3 into 10 raised to 8 meter per second. After how much time the signal received back after reflecting will be received back after reflecting. So same concept. Total distance 2D upon time. So time will be 2D upon V. 2 into this I can write 3 into 10 raised to 5. 3, 4, 5, 5 zeros. 3 into 10 raised to 8. So 2 into 10 raised to 5 minus 8 is minus 3 seconds. Sixth one more I am doing, then we do. A man is standing 48 meter away from wall, fires gun. Calculate the time after which you can hear it. So, if the speed of sound is 320 meter per second, speed is total distance upon time. So, time will be 2d upon t. 2 into 48 upon 320, 2 into 160, 16 into 10, 16 into 3, 0 0.3 second. Look. Okay, done. Yes, sir. Seven. A ship on the surface sends signal and receive it, it back from a submarine inside water after course. The distance of submarine from the Surface will be how much from the ship? How much if the speed of sound in water is given? One, four, five, zero meter per second. Again, same speed is total distance to go and come back to D. So D is VT upon two, B is one, four, five, zero, T is four upon two, two into two, four, zero, two into five, ten, two, four, seven, eight, one, nine. 2900 meter which you can write 2.9 kilo
dan Dan sir. A pendulum has frequency of five vibration per second. Five vibration per second. An observer starts the pendulum and fires a gun simultaneously. He hears echo from the clip after eight vibration of pendulum. So since echo is heard after eight vibration. So can you suggest me what will be the time? For one vibration, one upon t is the time. So into eight, correct or not? See, for one vibration, time is t. Into eight vibration, eight t. Hello. Hello? Yes, sir. One vibration for time period, we say, na? Yes, sir. So, if eight vibration was, so total time is eight times time period, no? Yes, sir. So one upon f into eight. That means one upon five into eight. So how much is time taken? One point six second. Any doubt? No, sir. No. Uh, what they want? Distance between clip and the observer. So speed is v. Total distance upon time. That is v t upon two. V is given three forty. P is one point six. Upon to zero point eight, so it is thirty four into eight decimal vanishes. Eight four the thirty two twenty four and one twenty five two fifty two meter. Uh, eight three the thirty two twenty four and three twenty seven two seventy two meter. Important one. Frequency five after eight vibration means one vibration into eight. So one upon f is called time period. Done, sir. A person standing between two vertical wall. Two 
two vertical wall first second two walls produces sound two successive echoes are heard after 4 second and 6 second the sound goes and comes back after 4 second from closer one and after 6 second from far one calculate distance between the clip so if this is d1 this is d2 total distance between clips will be d1 plus d2. so since speed is 2 times d1 upon t1 therefore d1 will be v t1 upon 2 d2 will be v t2 upon 2 this one follow this one follow no yes sir so distance between clip is t1 plus t2 which will be v t1 by 2 plus v t2 by 2 v by 2 take common t1 plus t2 so v is uh, 320 upon 2 4 plus 6 So it is two into one sixty. One sixty into ten. Therefore, distance is one thousand six hundred meter. So, Done, sir. A man fire guns and tears its echo after five seconds. Man moves three ten meter towards the clips and fires the gun again. This time he hears the echo after three seconds. That means the first distance is T one. This time is hearing after three seconds. Calculate the speed. Now see what is concept. If original distance is D one and new distance is he moved closer by two, how much he moved? Three hundred and ten. So difference between new distance and original distance is three hundred and ten. Correct now? Hello. Yes, sir. That means if D one is original distance. D two is new distance. Then original minus new is nothing but three hundred and ten. Yes, sir. So say uh, I am writing like this. Let D one 
comma d2 the original and new distance so we can say therefore d1 minus d2 is 310 meter but b is two times d1 upon t so d1 will be b p1 upon 2 and d2 you can write p t2 upon 2 therefore b t1 upon 2 minus d2 is b t2 upon 2 not followed hello this concept followed so difference yes, in sir. then i am finding d1 i am finding d2 substituting here this is also important sum So B by 2 is common. P1 minus T2 is 310. V by 2, 5 minus 3 is 310. V by 2 into 2 is 310. Therefore, V equals to 310 meter per second. So, On sending an ultrasonic wave from the ship towards the bottom, time interval between sending wave and receiving wave is total time 1.5. If velocity of wave is 1400, find the depth. So again, V is total distance upon time, which is Pt upon 2. V is 1400 into T 1.5 upon 2. So, 2 into 714, 700 into 1.5, 1, 70 into 15, 15 into 7, 1050. And <laughs> Okay. Is completed? Sir, one minute.
Done, sir. Now we'll do theory of this part. Test paper, both of you have not given? What, right. sir? Test paper? Sunday's test paper, both of you have not done? Uh, yes, sir. So I'm right now it is with you. Fall in front of me. <laughs> 